Right, so this is a stats program I started on a few months back and I plan on releasing it as open source code um, about a month or two as soon as I finish it. The reason I made it was because in college I was taking a stats class and the software ye we use was SPSS 19. That's a couple thousand dollars for a license so whenever I wasn't in that class I wasn't able to use the program and that's why I created my own. Uh, so the orange ones right here are the ones that are complete and these teal green ones are the ones I'm still working on. Um, so to show you some of the features here, if you want to generate a random number, enter your minimum, maximum number, get that, and then calculator, get that, frequency distribution. So if you wanted to know the frequency of a particular age group that was getting locked up in a, whatever jail, you can enter that here. Um, let's just say we want to know the frequency of teenagers that are getting locked up. Uh, let's just random data that I'm entering here. And enter the total intervals. Seven. Calculate it. And you got your cumulative frequency, your frequency percent, and your cumulative percent here. Um, depending on if you're using ordinal or uh, nominal data, you can get your mean mode average or median I'm not even sure if these are correct or not I'll have to double check that later but if you don't know what mean median or mode is you can find that here um, format if you want to change the format of it file you can save it or open up a different file if you saved one earlier now going to um, graphing it so if you want to graph uh, the frequency distribution that you just created, you just click this right here, generate a graph for you. Now, if we want to know the percent change, say um, we want to know the percent change of calls per officer between the year of 1991 and 1992, we can figure that out here. So percent change of calls per officer how many years are you comparing to what are the years we'll go 1991 1992 how many items are you comparing we're comparing to generate our table um, so this is a row item so this would be so shift one had 18 calls in 1991. In 1992, they had 21.4 calls. They had 21.4 calls. Row item two, we say shift two had 18.22. We'll say in 1992 they had 19. So we can calculate that. You can see your percent change right here. Also shows up here. For call percent officer, the percent change of shift one is 18. Point blah blah blah. And right here, if you want to see the formula for calculating percent change, it's right there. And that is all of the applications that I've made in this program thus far.